Hi, it's Paddy and welcome to day 589 of the Daily Do. Hesitation and urgency are part of the same confusion. Opposite ends of overwhelm and not knowing what you're doing. Headless chicken busyness or much chin stroking indecision are the signs of too much on your mind and a clouded inner vision. Very little's truly urgent and decisions easy when you're calm. Stop, sit still and let it go and from there you'll form a plan. If you're feeling that you can't sit still then that's the time you must. If you're hesitating through constant inner debating you must regain your trust. Find your centre by simply stopping and dropping hurry and self-doubt. Regain your focus in the silence. Remember what you're all about. And if you go to find the stillness and it simply isn't there, write down everything that comes to mind, the causes of your overwhelm. Empty out the washing machine of spinning thoughts and jobs. Write it out longhand. Don't try to make sense of this lot. Once you've written this, try again to sit still for a while. Push through the discomfort of not trying to sort the pile. Let go of feverish fretting. Busy, but busy doing what? We are made of what we're doing, but also of what we're not. Slowing down when all the world says speed up is a skill. Accepting things in silence saves you time and wasted will. Go slow if you want powerful decisions to be made. A thousand empty actions aren't worth one that you must make. And the quickest and most effective way to get what needs done, done, is to start by finding silence and slowing it all down. Then choose what is important. Do that one thing on your mind. It's not being busy that clears overwhelm. It's taking time to decide. The week rolls out before you and already there's lots to do. You feel it coming like a wave that's overwhelming you. Don't rush to stem the flow by getting any odd job done. Stop. Breathe. Break it down and then just start with one. If you'd like a morning email from The Daily Do, subscribe free at thedailydo.co in the box underneath the audio player. You can email me anytime, paddy at thedailydo.co. I'd love to hear from you. The Daily Do is available on all your favourite podcast places and on social media. Bye for now and see you tomorrow on The Daily Do.